He used to play Peach and Wii Fit Trainer back in Smash 4. Mm. He's probably kept both characters, to be honest, now that they both have been significantly better than their past counterparts. So mm. He actually won doubles at Breakthrough uh, last year. So, oh, okay. Or, 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 yeah, Breakthrough too. So definitely a very strong player from the Tijuana area as well. You know, the BTLC, the, the bacon, tomato, lettuce, cucumber team. Yes. That's what it stands for. Exactly. Not bootylicious or anything like that. That'd be just be yeah, that, silly. That'd be very inappropriate. No yeah. one would ever do that. Definitely not. So, who do you think's gonna win this one? We got Spanky Pokemon Trainer. Got that big upset on uh, Arrow, I would say. And Houston. Is it an upset on Arrow though? Uh, I don't know. I, I don't know. Anyways, uh, I think uh, I think Spanky's got this in the bag, but I think that's just because uh, Pokemon Trainer can kind of deal with Peach pretty well. well. Actually, both characters, I think. Alrighty, let's see though. What does Houston decide to play? Plays the name game or stage game. Starting PS2 to the surprise of no one at all. Really? I'm really surprised. I don't think that's our most common stage at all in SoCal. What? It definitely is. No, it's not. It's got to be Yoshi's Island Brawl, right? Oh, no. You're trolling. <laughs> oh, no. It's, it's, definitely, it's definitely Yoshi's Island Brawl or Yoshi's Story. No one that likes Yoshi's Brawl. We should just replace it with the stage people want, like WarioWare. Oh, that'd be that'd be hype. Yeah. Oh, I can't. I'd love to die like at forty. Twenty percent. Yeah. All right. Anyways, here we go. Houston's using Peach. Okay. This is still winner's time. Hmm. Let's see if Spanky can make some uh, upsets happen. Yeah. I don't know if it's an upset. I don't know who's really seated higher at this at the at this point of the of the bracket. But let's see. I wonder uh, what would prompt Houston to pick the weak figure. This piece looks really strong already versus Squirtle. Mm -hmm. Maybe if he thinks that the Peach isn't working and then he wants to match up jank them, maybe that's that's probably the right right opportunity to do it. Yeah, uh, I think in general this is really Ivysaur's a good game plan to have against a character like Peach. You know, you just use the Razor Leaf to anti air, just cover that like lateral space that Peach wants to occupy. Wow, the dare comes in. Still no up throw up there. Yeah, I thought he was I thought he was gonna go for it, guess not. Maybe the maybe this next one, if he gets it. And he's throwing out all those tails. The disjoints are real, man. Ooh! Yeah, Bowser's back there is like definitely his best move easily. Mm -hmm. It was I think that was his best move in Smash 4 as well, actually. Okay. Once you get back, yeah, that's, that's really one of the big things. Is it stops Peach from floating because the Razor Leaf just covers so much space. I have the dot eyes out. Not quite gonna go find anything off that. Okay, Spanky was really good here, though. Oh man. Oh whoa. whoa. He, he like he like di'd in, so he like flew up off the top. Yeah, that, at that point. That cr the cross up on that setup is so deadly. Meet a side B with another side B. Houston finally gonna be able to take a stock, but Spanky's looking really comfortable right now. Okay, I'm so is out. He's gonna go through the ledge game. Yeah, covers himself at the ledge with up air, like you mentioned before. Yeah, before. Uh, Sorry, I lost my train of thought. Uh, but before, though, um, Spanky was having a lot of trouble you know, getting his damage off. Uh, I wonder what Pokemon he thinks is best to combat Peach. Mm -hmm. We've seen all three do really well in the matchup so far, but really struggling with Ivysaur right now. Yeah, let's see, though. Oh, nice Razor Leaf. That can be the answer to the float, it seems like. Mm -hmm. Upstairs. Uh, oh, I tried to find the setup. Not quite, though. Okay, it's another tether. Yeah, that's Charizard. Oh, really risky. 
Uh, air dodge in. Not going to read the stock, but really close. Yeah, I actually paid dividends for him at that point. All right, up throw. No. He really does okay. not want to up throw. He doesn't, throw. doesn't want. He doesn't want us to have the satisfaction, man. Maybe in maybe in po maybe in pre-patch that would have killed. Yo, oh, yeah, for sure. Yeah. Sad life for the for the princess mains. Wow, yeah. up smash out of shield. Okay. Yeah, up smash. Yeah. Very nice stuff. First right. game going to Spanky over at Houston Peach. Let's see if uh, We Fit makes an appearance. Yeah, it was a two stock at that point, so maybe he is gonna look for the the matchup on familiarity. Because who the heck plays We Fit trainer besides Wadi and uh, and uh, Wadi? No, I, no idea. And me neither. Such an awkward character. It's like one of those things that you don't really ex expect. I, I know it's the troll pick of like Smash 4 along with Duck Hunt, but like at the same time, it's like. Really? Really? Yeah. <laughs> really? Banjo? Could have Banjo in, in Smash 4. But it's okay. We got, we got Banjo now, so it's fine. It's fine. Better. It's fine. I'm more interested in Hero, to be honest, but Banjo's cool. Too. Yeah, <laughs> you, get, you get to actually pick your RPG turn. Like, that, that's going to be hilarious to do. Anyways. Going back to Stadium 2, absolutely nothing has changed either. So, uh, yeah, we'll just uh, see if uh, Spanky can try to close it out with 2-0 or if Houston really figured out something this next game. And I don't even know if that down tilt's, like, plus on hit or not, but, like, he's been getting grabbed every single time afterwards. I think he's pretty much convinced him to shield after. Oof. Yeah, lots of damage going in so far. Oh man, watch the up airs. And the up B. Ivy Sword juggle potential is some of the scariest in the game. Yeah, definitely. How'd you get back? Alright, the vine whips. He just gets the cap vine whip. It's so fair. Oh, but I really respect that attempt to like juke him out. Have him off stage now where he wants him. Doesn't punish the roll again. They've been doing this every time. Up to an anti air. Net neutral air, put him off stage. Gets the flamethrower. That parasol somehow beats out fire. Maybe it's, maybe it's flame retardant block or something like that. Okay, up throw finally comes in. Looking for some low percent scroll combos. Like that? Have it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. We found it. <laughs> Call of Door the Explorer, we found it. Yeah, still having some trouble here to get in on Spanky. Still looking pretty good on this uh, first stock. Oh, I really respect the attempt at neutral air out of shield. He even drifted as far as he could yeah. to catch that, but just not quite enough. Peach Bomber is pretty safe on shield. Yeah. Usually you want to punish the option afterwards instead. Interesting. Oh! Oh! Okay, never mind. I thought he was going to go for like something crazy after that dare. I was like, wow, he really went for a dare in that position? Okay, goes low. No, oh, down here. Surprise me, you're back here. Okay, back here comes in. Okay. Now you have to worry about the Charizard. You should definitely be on the lookout for that move. <laughs> Up smash, back air, and Rogue Flare Blitz. And Fly. All very good moves. Yeah, it's up beat. Yes. Yeah, that was the first one I said. Oh, was it? Oh, <laughs> I, I heard, I heard, like, never mind, actually. Yeah. <laughs> okay, anyways. Anyway. Speaking of, though, Houston already getting 86% on the bank key. Looks like he's really trying to bring this back around. All right, Toad is in, save the day again. All of a sudden, very doable for either player, actually, to take this next stock. Oh, man, he's really looking for it. Okay. Do you think he'll go for it for a fourth time? Yes, definitely. Oh, man, he's got to look out, but there's the four here. Too much landing lag on the, on the back here, unfortunately. Is that a stitch? Looks like a stitch. Okay, Dan Spain doing a really good job of walling him out. Houston struggling to get this kill off of him. Yeah. 
I think Spanky's just having a difficult, he's doing a good job walling out, but he's having a difficult time returning back to neutral or trying to make some kind of advantage out of it. Because most of the time he's like losing stage because of it and he has to go back to a ledge and then he has to switch or something and then he can't do his original plan of keeping them out. So he's got to figure out a way to keep up the aggression again. The zoning was working before, but now I think he's got to start thinking about how to close out the stocks again because it's looking like he's in a tough position right now. Never mind. We're going to be back into an even game here. Okay, Squirrel's up to play now. Probably the best choice next to uh, Ivy Sword in this matchup. Mm -hmm. You got the early percent combos. You know, you got the Diddy Kong Fair. You got the up airs. Yeah, already yeah. back to even percent. Yeah, it has like Mario's up there. Yeah. It's like an amalgamation of like all these different moves inside of a tiny squirtle. Oh, the Ivy Sword's out. Just doesn't, just can't lose the setup now. A very open percent right now, 64. That's. A lot of opportunities to find uh, Vine Whip at this point. Oh, Whew. Nurch forward air to the rescue. Oh boy. Okay, gonna come back. I should get back from the ledge. Oh, I thought that back air was gonna land. That would've been scary. Man, all these back airs hitting shield. And he went for the raw flare blitz right there. I really respect the attempt, but not quite finding it. The up air barely doesn't kill either. Yo, man, I would just flare bit to Glenn, man. Yeah. Like, just do it, man. Like, what do you have to lose at this yeah, point? You're already at 150, up. you know? Still fighting. Just do it, man. I can Dude, feel it. Really close situation right now. Oh! Oh, wow, that's there it. There it is. Houston tying it up 1 1. Let's see what yeah. uh, Spanky's going to do here to win this set. I know he has a fox as well. I don't know if he's. I don't think the. Enough. I. Every time I've seen the fox, it hasn't done so hot. So, yeah. I feel like he's just gonna stick with the trainer at this point. But let's see, man. Yeah, sticking with the trainer. Okay. Are we going to the same stage though? This is Spanky's counter pick. I don't know. <laughs> Did you guys see that on camera? I don't even know, actually. Are they looking for a TO or something? What? What's going on? I don't know. They look like he, Spanky looks like he's got a question. I'm not sure, though. I think he might be asking if it's best to fly. Water break? <laughs> no, it's not. It's just, this is quarters, so I think it's right before top eight. So. All righty, let's see here. It is 10. Do you think we'll be out by midnight? No. Do you Not think we'll all. be out by 1 a.m.? Hopefully. Hopefully. Also no. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> all righty, let's see here. We're going to FD, actually, this time around. Okay. I can see it. Down throw back air. Another one? Yeah. Let's yeah. get the sweet spot, bro. Mm -hmm. Dude, obviously, his up B's angles are so tricky. Yeah. He's going so many different ways. I mean, it's like a super strong move on top of that. Oh, he hesitated a little bit. Didn't quite get anything off of it. Houston actually controlling the space really well on FD. I'm a little bit surprised because I've seen all of like the peach combos happen on FD, personally. So uh, we'll, we'll see. Like Spanky still hasn't lost the first stock yet, so he's still got an opportunity to bring this back around. Vine was through the ledge again. How do you yeah. even prepare for that? Microspace it. I don't know. Oh, the Toad! Spread that perfume. Is that what we're calling it? No, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I just thought of the first thing. I was like, What's, what, the, what does that look like? It looks like perfume, kind of. Anyways, let's see. Now, all of a sudden, Houston's got the first stock. Oh, that's really big, actually. Opens up a lot of percents here. Now we got another. <laughs> Spanky yelling out um, some, some very strong words. Uh -huh. 
as he gets hit by more Peach stuff. Yeah, he's being denied his actual, like, a lot of his different approaches right now. Okay. Fine with Desert, though. Quick 78 before the show. <laughs> anyway. Every piece does like a raw charge for, uh, up smash at least once in neutral. Yeah, at least once. Okay, we got the juggles coming in. All right, yeah, he's, now he's starting to get kind of back into a flow of it, getting a big combo there. Just gotta be careful on the, the space that Peach occupies. You can definitely get hit by a bunch of landing hitboxes before you know it, like that. Oh, there's a turn up slide, he's gonna get another one? Okay, I thought he was gonna throw it off the stage, like down, but he got it. Oh man. That oh, would, that would have been really good. Very close. Yeah. Dude, look at that range of vine with those like through the ledge almost from off stage. It's crazy. Yeah. Oh, that was unfortunate. He kinda just left himself hanging there with that full hop neutral air. Now potential last stock for Spanky. Oh, it looks like he's uh, about to get comboed to 40. He's gotta get out of there somehow. Ooh! Yeah, you can't get this in his face, taking so much damage. Yeah, already switching back to Charizard. This is not looking good, though. I think, uh... Oh, switching to Squirtle. That's a little risky. Yeah. yeah. That. Forty, almost Squirtle. Oh, turn up snipe. Another one. Oh, that's it. No, never mind. He had his jump. Okay, he's still back in it. Never mind. He's gone. All right, Houston does Houston. it. He moves on to winner semis. Taking out Spanky. Looked really strong up against Arrow earlier, but... Not enough.